pouring fire ants through a funnel is not something you should try at home. Nobody wants that many fire ants in their home. But for researchers interested in the physics of fluids, it's irresistible because they have found that ants act as both a fluid and a solid. See how the ants drip like some kind of syrup? But then, watch as a researcher pushes down on a ball of ants. It springs back, as if it were a solid, like rubber. That's a rare combination, and nobody had seen a group of living things behave that way before. Now, the researchers didn't just poke at the ants and pour them out of tea kettles and put them through funnels. They did serious ant ball physics with lab devices that tested the viscosity and the springiness of a ball of ants. To flow, the ants move around. To spring back, they hang on to each other. These observations could be helpful in making robots that put themselves together out of little bits, or making self-healing materials. When the ants turn themselves into a bridge, they can repair breaks. Why can't concrete do the same? 